Right here in our hemisphere, there's a very dramatic confrontation playing out in the streets of Caracas, Venezuela, where the people there are standing up to a narco dictatorship that has denied their basic rights, failed to respect elections. Also what's happening is that the inter-American community is standing up after about 10 years of ignoring this problem and marshalling a response saying that the regime there is accountable to its international commitments to respect the separation of powers and democratic order and to respect human rights. And they've called for elections to bring about a democratic transition in that country. The United States is standing with the inter-American community, playing a supportive role by bringing sanctions against individuals at the very top of that government, the Vice President of Venezuela, as a matter of fact, for engaging in narco-trafficking and money laundering and violating our laws. Finally, the Venezuelan people feel that they're not isolated, that the United States and their neighbors are standing with them as they call for the restoration of democratic order in that country. What should the U.S. role be in helping Venezuelans restore democracy in their country? Please let us know in your comments and also let us know what other topics you want AEI scholars to cover in 60 seconds.